Hello, good morning. My name is May uh, and I'm an English teacher. Today we're going to talk about conditionals, um, specifically about if two, conditional number two. Conditional number two, let's uh, only just uh, uh, refresh our memories about conditionals. Conditionals are sentences with two clauses, the if clause and the main clause, which is uh, the if part and the result. Now we have three different uh, kinds or type of conditionals, if one, if two, and three. Today we're going to talk about the second one. If two talks about unreal situations. Unreal situations or maybe impossible, almost impossible. I wouldn't say impossible, but I would say that there are very, some situations that are very unlikely to happen. So, for example, uh, if I um, had, if I won the lottery, if I won the lottery, I would buy a big house. Let's write it down. If I won the lottery, comma, I would buy a big house. This is the first part. If. The if can they word, the conditional word, and this is the second part, the result. Let's take a look at the structure, the grammatical, the, gra the grammatical, the grammatical structure. If the if word, I won, that would be past, past simple. I would buy the result. I would buy that would be the past of will. The past of will would be would. And by B1. So the structure would be if plus past simple would plus B1. Okay? Now, if I look, if I take a look at if one, if one talks about real situations, if two talks about unreal situations. Now, if one, if one talks about a plus present simple and the result would be will plus v1. This is the structure for if one. I wrote it here so you can stress out the differences. What happened between if one and if two? Present simple, I have to go one step backward and I get past. Will, it's verb to be will right, in the present, right, in the present tense, and I have to go one step back up, backward, I get would. So between if one and if two, I took one step backward in tenses, in the timeline. So I get the past and would. That's it. Now, if I see that, I take a look at the, at the, at the situation and I see that it's something, I mean, it's not real, it's unreal, and it's unlikely to happen. I wouldn't say impossible because I might won the lottery and I would buy the uh, a very big house or whatever, but it's very unlikely to happen. Okay? That's it. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you liked it, please leave us a, uh, a comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.